Friends, we welcome you to the Other Mind channel. Today, let's talk about river monsters. Do you often think about what monsters may live in rivers and whether it's dangerous to swim in them? In this regard, our rivers are much safer than, for example, in Africa, Australia or America. We've prepared for you 20 of the scariest river dwellers on the planet. Let's go! Flathead Catfish Meet one of the most dangerous river dwellers in North America. The flathead catfish can be up to one and a half meters long and weigh over 100 kilograms. The catfish's diet consists of waterfowl, other fish, and mammals. But there are also cases of attacks on people. For example, up to 10 fishermen per year are killed in North American rivers. Attacking its prey, the flathead catfish tears it to pieces with its powerful jaws. Vandalia serosa or kangaroo. This small fish at first glance does not raise any concerns, but it's only so it appears. You will be shocked to learn that it feeds on blood and urine, penetrating the anus and genital urinary organs. Then the Vandalia serosa begins to devour the flesh. You can't remove this parasite on your own, you'll need surgery. One good thing is that this fish lives far away from us in the Amazon River in Colombia, Brazil, Peru and Ecuador. Piranha the piranha is a relatively small predator, growing up to 30 centimeters in length, but terrifying to people. Piranhas live in Brazil and South America. Having a large number of teeth and being always in search of prey, piranhas pose a tremendous danger to anyone who meets them on the way. Piranhas hunt in large packs. They swallow small fish and start tearing off pieces of meat from larger ones. In a matter of minutes, a pack of piranhas can leave only the bones of their prey. Electric Eel Lacking a powerful jaw and huge teeth, this fish poses an enormous danger to people. It does not need teeth to do this. It will, at lightning speed, generate a powerful discharge of electricity which can cause a person to lose consciousness. Do not approach the eel closer than 3 meters, because this is the range of its current. In addition, the electric eel is quite aggressive and often attacks for no reason. You can meet this fish up to 3 meters long and weighing up to 40 kilograms in the Amazon River and other rivers in the northeast of South America. Begarius urali or Gunj catfish. This catfish can be found in the Kali River area between India and Nepal, as well as in the Brahmaputra, Indus and Ganges river basins. Since ancient times the bodies of the dead have been dumped into this river. Often bodies do not burn completely and catfish feed on human remains. These huge predators weigh up to 140 kilograms and often attack people in search of food. Tambaki it's an amazing fish with teeth that are very similar to human teeth but much sharper. That's why the tambaki easily gnaws fruits and nuts that fall into the river from the trees. It lives in the Amazon River and also eats invertebrates and fish. In the 90s, tambaki attacked two fishermen who died from blood loss. It grows to an average of about 70 to 100 centimeters and weighs about 40 kilograms. The tambaki looks a bit like piranhas, only larger in size. Hydrocinus goliath, or giant tiger fish. This dangerous aquatic dweller can be found in Africa in the Congo River. But it's better not to meet with it because this fish is quite a dangerous predator and it's like a real tiger while attacking other fish and even people. I don't want anyone to face a 50 kilogram monster that grows up to 180 centimeters in length. To easily cope with prey, the giant tiger fish has 32 sharp teeth. You can learn more about the giant tiger fish in our separate video. A link is in the description. Black Cayman This giant monster with lightning fast reaction and great strength grows up to 6 meters long. It's better not to get in its way, the caiman would tear anyone to shreds. The black caiman is one of the largest crocodiles and is the largest predator in the Amazon River. The black caiman is an omnivore. Its diet is dominated by fish, vegetation, crustaceans and insects. Adults hunt for the larger prey. The caiman hunts mammals, snakes, waterfowl and fish. Black caimans have repeatedly attacked people. 
giant freshwater stingray or short-tailed river stingray. They live in the rivers of Thailand, Indonesia, Malaysia, Australia and New Guinea. These giants weigh about 500 kg and are up to 2 meters in diameter. This stingray is quite dangerous because it has two sharp spikes on the tail. The large spike helps to hold the victim down. Such a spike looks like a harpoon and it's difficult to pull out because of the large number of serrations on it. The stingray can easily pierce the bottom of a boat with a spike which grows to almost 40 centimeters. A stingray will never attack a person first. For that, you either have to accidentally disturb it or try to catch it. The second spike is smaller, but its purpose is to inject venom that can kill a person. Freshwater stingrays are viviparous, with a female giving birth to a single calf up to 35 centimeters in length. The number of giant freshwater stingrays is decreasing, so it's forbidden to hunt them. After the photo shoot and measurements, the stingrays are returned to the river. Anaconda for people who are afraid of snakes, the anaconda will be a real challenge. This monster reaches a length of up to 5 to 6 meters and weighs about 50 to 70 kilograms. If the anaconda begins to coil itself around its victim, it can no longer escape. It lives in the Amazon River and likes to rest in shallow water. Anaconda is the largest snake on the planet and is not poisonous. Giant Otter Inhabiting the Amazon rivers, otters are quite large, up to 2 meters in length. An individual otter on its own is not so dangerous, but when they gather in packs, these animals can kill even large caimans and anacondas. Arapaima It's a giant monster with teeth even on its tongue. Even piranhas are no threat to them because they have armored scales. Arapaima grows up to 3 meters and weighs about 90 kilograms. It feeds on fish and waterfowl. There have been recorded cases of this giant attacking humans as well. Bull sharks. These sharks usually live in the ocean, but they're also excellent in rivers. It's not uncommon for them to swim very far down the Amazon, where they look for their prey. They grow up to 3 meters and the strength of their bite reaches 600 kilograms. It's better never to encounter this predator, because afterward the chances of survival are close to zero. Hydraulicus scamberoides It's a true vampire among river dwellers. This fish has huge fangs up to 15 centimeters, which do not give the victim a chance. It lives in the Amazon, grows up to 117 centimeters, and weighs about 18 kilograms. It feeds on piranhas and other fish. This fish is very often the object of sport fishing due to its powerful resistance when trying to pull it out of the river. The locals also go fishing for the Hydraulicus scomboroidus, considering its meat very delicious. Protopterus. They live in the water bodies of Africa and belong to the lungfish species. When a body of water dries up, the Protopterus burrows into the ground and hibernates. It usually happens every year and such hibernation lasts several months. But the main feature of Protopterus is that they can stay in such a state for up to four years. The largest of the Protopterus species is the marbled longfish. It reaches up to 2 meters in length and weighs about 17 kilograms. They are nocturnal, can move with the help of fins on the bottom, and can swim in the water like eels. They feed on crabs, crayfish, mollusks, and fish. The local population often catches Protopterus and eat them. Nile perch. This perch is striking in its size. The largest specimens grow up to 2 meters in length and weigh up to 200 kilograms. The ancient Egyptians called this fish the Princess of the Nile. They can live in any freshwater body of water, preferring warm waters. The Nile perch is a true predator. It's not uncommon for this monster to choose its prey among its own species. It's the largest predatory fish of Lake Victoria. This giant has been artificially introduced into other bodies of water, which has had a negative impact. The perch is a real glutton, so the number of local fish species has significantly decreased. A very unusual fact is that the Nile perch hatches its young in its mouth, protecting its next generation. Nile Crocodile This crocodile inhabits the territory of the African continent. It's considered one of the deadliest creatures on the planet. 
Males can grow up to 5 meters, even one such monster is very dangerous. When they hunt in a pack, the victim has no chance of survival. They can attack even rhinos and hippos. Quite often, people become victims of this crocodile. Every year, from several hundred to a couple of thousand people die from its teeth. Northern snakehead. These fish are quite rare in the West, but there was a case when a fisherman found the northern snakehead in a pond in the United States. Many scientists believe that snakeheads can take root in North America, thereby seriously damaging the local ecosystem. These predatory fish grow up to a meter in length and are very voracious. Their diet consists of frogs, fish, and invertebrates. Northern snakeheads can live outside of the water for up to four days. Sawfish The small-toothed sawfish lives in freshwater. Sometimes it even swims into lakes. It chooses muddy and shallow water, spending most of its time on the bottom. It is similar to saw rays, not sharks, as it might seem at first glance. They are distinguished by the long, flat rostrum, laterally dotted with tooth-like outgrowths. It doesn't attack people on purpose, but due to poor eyesight, this fish can accidentally inflict quite dangerous saw blows. Today, these fish are protected because of the decline in their numbers. Leech This little parasite feeds on blood and is usually not very dangerous. On average, a leech feeds for half an hour and then detaches itself. However, bleeding after such a sting can last for several days, especially if you have several leeches hooked on you. A leech can transmit infections and parasites to humans because it has no immune system. In Africa, even the hepatitis B virus and HIV have been found in wild leeches. Some of the leeches can enter the nose, eyes, ears, bladder, and even the stomach. That was our top 20 scariest river dwellers. Share in the comments which animal surprised you the most. Give us a like if the video was useful and subscribe to the channel. We still have a lot of interesting things. See you next time!